There was a video that came out of India where one of the Nigerian brothers, you know, was showing that India has been deporting, mass deporting uh, Nigerian people from their country. Let's go ahead and roll that. So please, we are making this video for the Nigerian government to please, please, if they, if really, true, if truly they have the interest of Nigerians at heart, they will come to the head out, they will reach out to the Indian government for proper at least negotiation in order for these little children to go. While there are some other children over here, who some of them, they've lost their parents, some of them, their parents are in jail, and they need to go back home to reunite with their extended family, but they are all been denied here. So please and please, we are begging the federal government of Nigeria to at least do something about it. And I want to plead, I want to plead with all Nigerians to at least spread this video, share it all over every platform. Share this video over every platform so so that it can reach out to the appropriate authority in order for them to do the necessary things. So please, we are making this video for the Nigerian government to please, please, if they, if really, true, if truly they have the interest of Nigerians at heart, they will come to the head out, they will reach out to the Indian government for proper at least negotiation in order for these little children to go. While there are some other children over here who some of them, they've lost their parents. You know, over the years I have been seeing these videos pop up more and more all the time. Remember the Chinese had originally started doing that to Nigerians during the time of the virus, B blaming them for the virus. I'm like, really? You try to blame Nigerians? Then we've seen videos out of Dubai. We've seen different videos out of, uh, I think it was Saudi Arabia or different, just different places where they're just di directly deporting Nigerians. In that particular clip, it said there's a lot of Indians that live in Nigeria. Well, I will say this, this is when it comes to the weakness of African governments. There ain't no way that I'll be the president of Nigeria and I don't retaliate. If I look at that video and I see my people being just kicked out, I'm gonna call them and say, why are you kicking my people out? Well, we don't want them here with, okay, no problem. Well, I'm telling you right now, call your citizens and let them know that I'm about to start deporting them and you banned from my country. I want them out of here. I said, because if you're gonna do that to my citizens, yours gotta go too. We will play tit for tat. I don't know why African governments don't wanna do that. I'll play tit for tat all the time. Whatever you do to my people, I'm doing to yours. So treat my people nice and I'm greatly gonna treat your people nice. Nigeria needs to start standing up to these other countries and letting them know how it's gonna be with their citizens. If not, you're banned from my country, that's all. You, you're banned, you, you can't come in here, your people gotta go, they can't be here. I don't care if they're citizens, they gotta go. They gotta go, they can't be here because of what you're doing to Nigerian citizens. You're not gonna have some, having yourself in, in, in Nigeria, living it up and doing all kinds of things you wanna do in Nigeria, but then Nigerians can't be over there? No, it's just that simple. And, and, and Nigerian citizens need to be saying something about this and demand their government do something. Now, bring those people home and kick those people out and ban them from your country. That's all the way you have to be. People don't understand niceness. I learned that a long time ago. People understand is you give them a taste of their own medicine. When you give them back what they did to you, then they'll understand. Now you can call it an eye for an eye, a two for a tooth, but that's the only way people get it. Unfortunately, that's the only way to get it. Well, y'all let me know what y'all think about this and Nigerians that could be in the chat. You know, I mean, uh, what, what's going to be the process? I mean, how y'all going to start getting these banned in India and getting them out of your country too? Because if they doing that to your people, putting out children, women, throwing them out there at the airport to get on out of there, y'all need to do the exact same thing to their people.